KETK News. You're watching East Texas Live. Welcome on back to East Texas Live on KDK. And joining us now from the Tyler Smith County chapter of Texas X's is Tom Perkins. And he's here to talk about a scholarship dinner coming up. But first of all, I just kind of wanted to talk to you about what Texas X's does for the community in general. You do so much. Can you just dive in a little bit for me? You know, Sarah, thank you for that. Actually, um, for a number of years, going back decades, the Texas X's have been very involved in the local community. Um, for example, uh, we, we, we've adopted Earl Campbell Parkway uh, mm -hmm. and the Keep Tyler Beautiful program. When we, we're out there uh, cleaning up every, every quarter, uh, we support a lot, a lot of local charities. We just raised funds uh, recently for the SPCA. Mm -hmm. uh, we also uh, do a lot of social things. We uh, host a Thirsty Thursday, <laughs> uh, the second Thursday of every month at a different local uh, 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 restaurant here in town. Um, and, of course, we host uh, football game watching parties uh, yeah. during the fall. Now, one of the reasons you're here is because you guys have a huge scholarship dinner coming up. This is going to be big for our community. Talk to me a little bit about that. Absolutely. I'm really excited about that. It's going to be July 29th at Holly Tree Country Club starting at 6 p.m. Uh, we are honoring a number of people this year. It's especially important this year because we weren't able to do our, our annual dinner last year. Um, now, uh, every year we give out in the neighborhood about $10,000 uh, for scholarships for rising incoming freshmen to UT Austin. Um, this year we're going to be able to honor, I'm real excited, the uh, recipients from last year as well as this year. So we're going to have about nine uh, students uh, that are going to be participating, which is exciting. We're also honoring uh, what we call our most valuable Longhorns, <laughs> which are our local people that are very active in the uh, chapter. Uh, that's Bill and Marie Landry, very, uh, very deserving of that honor. And uh, probably most importantly, we're honoring uh, Chairman Kevin Eltyf this year as our distinguished graduate, mm -hmm. uh, who, as you know, has been extremely involved, uh, not only in the local community, but in the state of Texas. He's a former Tyler City Councilman, mm -hmm. Uh, former mayor, Texas uh, state senator uh, from this district, and is currently the chairman of the Board of Regents uh, for the UT system, which covers all 14 um, uh, locations for the UT system. That's so incredible what this scholarship does for these, you know, uh, Texans going into their freshman year of college or some sophomore year like last year. But uh, what does this mean to them? Have you heard any of their personal stories on how this scholarship has really benefited them? So it's one of my favorite parts about the scholarship dinner, actually. We always ask someone back that was a previous recipient, and, and typically a, a recent graduate, on what did it mean for you to receive um, that, that scholarship while you were going into the, into the program. And we've heard some, some just great stories mm -hmm. about um, how that payment might have made a difference between being able to stay for another semester or having to come home or, or, or changing locations. So it really is heartfelt. Um, I think the, the chapter, again, going back historically, ha has had a huge impact on, on students' lives. And, and certainly, we, we absolutely value education. Mm -hmm. um, and that's a, a central tenant to the values of the group. Well, Tom, one last thing before you go. Is there anything else that we should know about the, the scholarship dinner or Texas X's in general? Well, the, the other exciting news I, I want to make sure that everybody understands is that uh, not only are we honoring Chairman Eltyfe, but we are our keynote speaker this year is uh, Vice President and Athletics Director for the UT Austin system, uh, Chris Del Conte. And, and I actually want to uh, congratulate Chris and his team. Uh, just this morning it was announced that the University of Texas Athletic Department won uh, the College Directors Cup for the first time in school history as the best athletic department in the country. Mm. Uh, Stanford has won it for the last 25 years straight and we finally uh, took it away from them. Uh, so I know him and his staff are real proud. And, and we're really excited to have him here in the community uh, coming off a, a great victory like that. That's huge. Okay, so what do you guys say uh, for Texas? I'm from USC. I'm sorry. I know it, it's bad. But is it Hook'em? Hook'em Horns. Hook Absolutely. Like this. Hook'em Horns. <laughs> well, awesome. Tom, thank you so much for joining us today. And thank you for all that you guys do for our community. It, it is really paramount to our success. And we look forward to seeing what else you guys are going to do in the future. Thank you, Sarah. All right. Don't go anywhere, anybody. When we come back with the second half hour of East Texas Live in just a few, about two minutes, we'll have more news. Stay with us.